good players, hard workers, guys that are committed to being successful, you know, fighting to get better every day, working extremely hard on individual skill as well as in the weight room. And I think the biggest key is for us just really trying to improve individual skill. When you're kind of on this gathering information, learning their strengths and weaknesses, what are the things that you look at? When you're willing to make a commitment to do what we need to do as a team to be successful, I think all those things are very important because we can talk about it all the time. What do we do when we deal with adversity? How do you handle adversity? How do you handle tough times? Are you willing to fight through those things? When do you start to try to implement style and, and, and system and all that kind of stuff? And then what's, what's that process like? We do it within our individual workouts. So everything we do from a skill standpoint, it leads up into what we do as a whole. We do a lot of five on zero, uh, two on zero, meaning offensive stuff, three on zero offensively. And then we put it all together. So I think once we get into J June and July, that's when we'll put five on five together. The guys are shooting the ball very well in the workouts. They're shooting the ball extremely well. And that's, that's even big read. Now big read, his number one strength is probably not shooting threes, but he's making three-point shots, and we spend so much time perimeter shooting, perimeter shooting, uh, sprint to the rim, making plays, having spacing, all those things that help us when we go five on five. The desire from the fan base for this program to return to the levels they're used to is, is, is so high. I mean, have, have you been able to feel that as you've gone around? Oh yeah, I've been able to feel it. And the great thing about our players are able to feel it. I think that's great for our players to go into the summertime with some momentum, uh, to have some confidence, some good energy, good enthusiasm. I think that part is great, but I've felt it from day one. We need a packed house every night. I don't think that needs to be an option. It's our job to put ourselves in a position to be a successful basketball program, not just next season, but to consistently be a successful basketball program. But I think in order to do it, and I've said it to our fans uh, probably a hundred times now, we need them to be in the arena. I've been in this arena when it's very loud, so I know what that feels like, So, and we need that. But I like to be on the good side of that loud. And as you get ready to go into the summertime, what's your message to your team? The one thing I've said to our players, we're not that far off, guys. There are some things we need to do to get better, but we're not that far off. we got to work extremely hard. We have to be able to play well together. We have to have a passion for being successful. And we have to be able to deal with it and manage through tough times and navigate through them.